Hello YouTube and welcome to Destination Lego and welcome to another unbagging build and review video. So today we have a promotional poly bag and this is set 30265 and this is Warri's fire bike. Um, I don't have a piece count for this, that's because here in the UK we don't have a piece count on the bag and I'm looking on brick set at the moment and today is the 19th of July 2014 as of yet the set has not been reviewed so there is no piece count um, on that website either. So like I said this is a promotional poly bag certainly here in the UK um, for the I think it's the last two weeks in July you can pick this one up when you spend £25 or more in the Lego store or the Lego store online so I picked this up today when I bought my Lego um, Mini Cooper set 10242 and that will be in a separate review video so keep an eye out for that one. Okay so let's get this bag opened up and take a look at the pieces and instructions. Okay so opening up the poly bag. So there we go, emptied out. So I'm not going to count the pieces, but I'm guessing looking at that round about 40. That's my guess anyway, around about 40 um, pieces. Here's the instructions. Oh, very small instructions. Um, so that's the size of our instruction manual. That's one side and that's the second side, so there's only eight steps. Um, yeah, so that's it for the instruction manual. Um, obviously there we can see the pieces. Um, obviously it does come with that minifigure too. So let's get this set built. Okay, there we go, that's my build complete for Warriors Firebike, this awesome little poly bag. Um, we can see there in the front, or at the front of this set, there are one, two, three, four, five, six spare pieces that come with this poly bag, so let's get those out of the way now. Okay, so let's start off by taking a 360 view of both the bike and minifigure. Okay, and there we go back round to the front view. So let's take a closer look at that minifigure. Okay, and there we can see some really awesome looking print into the front of that torso and down into the legs. Let's take a look at the rear. And again, we got some printing going round to the rear of the torso. Okay, now taking a look at the face. It is a two sided face. So there's the first version. Let's take a look at the second version now. Okay, and there's that second version, obviously a little bit more angry looking. And very awesome looking um, mask or headpiece there. Um, that is particularly cool, I really do like that. I must say I don't collect these Chima sets, um, but some of the minifigures have got a lot of detail in them, I have to say, and that does look pretty awesome. So. Very cool minifigure in my opinion. I really do like this. It's obviously a promotional poly bag. Um, let's take a look at the fire bike now. Uh, there we go, a bit of a close look at that fire bike. There we can see on the side there, we've got the fire or the flame coming out of the front. Just gonna pick that up there. We've obviously got the place for the minifigure to be seated there and we'll do that in a second. It's a bit of detailing on this side. Pretty cool use of piece there to make that wheel hub. Um, pretty chunky tyres, um, as we can see there, obviously rear and front. Obviously the Technic piece there which holds it, holds it in sight. And obviously there's the handlebars, so let's get the minifigure. Oh, and let's just seat 
that minifigure on to the bike there. So there we can go now, obviously, with that minifigure now in the seated position. And obviously the set also comes with the um, translucent orange gem um, piece as well, which we can see there just in the front of the bike. So all in all, I think this is a very cool promotional poly bag. Um, as always with Lego, they do do some very cool promotional poly bags. So again, I would recommend trying to get hold of this one. Um, and I think it's very good value. Um, certainly here in the UK, you only have to spend over 25 pounds in the Lego store or the Lego store online. And you will get this free as part of that purchase. So there we go, that's my unbag, build and review all done and complete. And hopefully you did enjoy this video. If you did, please do go ahead and give it that thumbs up. Any comments, questions, feedback, always welcomed down in that comment section. And if you haven't done so already, please do go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Destination Lego, go ahead, go on, hit that subscribe button, please. Go on, support me, you can do it, hit the button. And I look forward to seeing you all in the next video. Cheers!